You know, I often get asked, when is it necessary to completely remove failing paint versus just spot prepping? Now, before I answer that question, let's discuss what poor intercoat adhesion is. You know, over the years, surfaces will receive many layers of paint. Because people often don't take the time to properly clean and prepare a surface before they apply each coat, one of those lower layers of paint might not be able to support the weight and pull that is created by another coat of paint, causing the entire coating to peel with very little effort. Now, I recommend before you paint any surface that you do an adhesion test. There are two reasons to perform an adhesion test. One is to identify poor intercoat adhesion. Another is to confirm that the coating system that you're about to apply is going to stick before you complete the whole job. The adhesion test method that I prefer is to make small cuts in the coating with a razor knife. Now be careful not to cut too deeply into the wood. Then place 3M 2020 white tape over the cuts, rub a few times to make sure the tape is firmly adhered, then remove. If the tape removes more than 10 to 15 percent of the coating, I would advise you to completely strip the coating and start over. In this example, I tested a well-known primer from Home Depot and a quality water-based enamel. This is the paint system that they recommended when painting over lacquer, which is most commonly found on cabinetry. Now, as you can see, more than 15% of the coating came off, so I would definitely recommend avoiding this primer in this situation. In my next video, I will show you step-by-step -step how we strip paint, what products and tools we use, what primer we recommend, and which finish coats. The next video is titled Stripping Paint from a Front Door. Thanks for watching.